You, me, we, move. Hey everyone, my name is Victoria and I am here in the Ability Center. Hey everyone, Caitlin here, and today myself and Victoria are really excited for our power and strength session. So before we start, we gotta get our warm up in, so let's get started. All right, for our warm up today, we are going to do the five minute countdown. This is going to consist of five different moves, which we will all do for one minute. So let's get started. Our first movement that we are going to do is marching high knees. So all, if you're standing, we're just gonna bring those knees as high as you can into a nice little march, and you can get those arms pumping as well. If you are seated in a chair, as Caitlin is, she is going to, again, same thing, alternate those knees, lifting as high as she can to her chest, and she's pumping those arms. So here we go, let's do that together for one minute in three, two, one, Let's go. All right, guys. We're pumping. All we're right. marching. We're climbing that mountain. Let's go, let's go. Good job, friends. Let's go. Keep going, keep Ooh. marching. Getting those bodies moving. Getting those bodies warm. Yes. All right, we're almost about halfway there. Woo. Awesome. Good job, guys. Keep pushing. Almost at the top of that mountain. Woo. My legs on fire. All right, we got about 20 seconds left. We can do this. Let's go, let's go. Good job, guys. 10 seconds. Awesome. All right, in five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Nice. All right, on to our next movement. We're gonna be doing some jumping jacks. So if you are seated or standing, all we're gonna do is we're going to shoot our leg out to the right, shoot our leg out to the left, and as we do that, our arms are going to come above our head. If you're standing doing this, you can shoot both your legs out left and right into a nice little straddle there, like a jump, and then arms up, and then come back together. All right, guys, here we go for one minute in three, Two and one, let's go. All right. So again, I'm seated. I'm alternating left and right here. Bring my feet out to the side. Victoria is standing. She's doing her jumping jacks. Jumping those feet out and in. We're both raising our arms Woo. over our head. Good job, good job. Awesome, keep it up. We're jumping for joy here, guys. Jumping for joy. Let's we go. We love let's a good strength and power workout. Woo, woo. Getting that heart rate up. Almost there, guys, about halfway here. Here we go. Let's go, let's go. Good job. All right, we got 10 seconds left. Let's go, don't stop now. Good job, good job. Five, four, three, two, and Woo! one. Nice, Woo! nicely done. Grab a drink if you need it. We're almost there though. Let's keep going. Moving on to our third movement, we are going to do some fast feet. So it's exactly what it sounds like. We're gonna try to move those feet as fast as we can if you are standing or you are seated. You can also get those arms pumping however you feel best, all right? For one minute, here we go. In three, two, one, let's go. Oh, get man. those feet going. You can even go down in a nice little squat if you want. Kind of like a football stance. Ooh, as fast as you can. Let's pretend we're running the, the 100 meter sprint here. We're moving down the track. We're moving down the track. Here we go, here we go. Awesome. About halfway there. Here we go, guys. Let's go, let's go. Woo! 20 seconds. Let's go, guys. Don't stop, keep moving fast as you can. Feel that burn in your legs. <sighs> 10 seconds. Woo! Let's go, let's go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Oh, amazing, great race, great race. Woo. All right guys, into our fourth movement for our five minute countdown, we're gonna get into some jump squats here, all right? So remember in your squat, you wanna shoot your bum backwards like you're sitting 
or going to be sitting into a chair, all right? So for our jump squats, if you're standing, again, shooting them bum back, bending those knees, all right? Keeping your chest up nice and tall and a nice explosive jump at the top here. For our seated, I'm just going to alternate my right and my left leg here, bringing that knee up nice and high giving that knee a little tap with my hands here, all right? So again, go as fast or as slow as you would like. So however you wanna do this, let's do our jump squats in three, two, and one. Let's go, guys. One minute here, our jump squats. So again, really feeling that burn in our legs. Let's imagine ourselves jumping in muddy puddles, all right? It is a beautiful rainy day, and we are jumping in all sorts of puddles. Nice. Go at your own pace. It's just a warm up. Woo! Good job, guys. Good job. Almost there. About halfway. Let's go. Feel the burn. Love the burn. Here Woo! we go, guys. 20 seconds. Let's go. You got it, Victoria. Almost there. Good job. Good job. All right. We got 10 seconds left. Don't stop now. Don't stop. Here we go, guys. All those muddy puddles in five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Shake it out, shake it out. Good job, Definitely good job. gotta shake out those legs. All right, last final movement for our warm up. We're gonna do some ski jumps downhill. We're gonna move down that hill. So if you're standing, all this is gonna do, all we're, wow. If you're standing for this movement, we are going to jump to the left with our left foot and our right foot's gonna come behind us off the ground. Onto our right foot, the left is gonna come behind us. Your arms are just gonna swing in front of you. Just like that, awesome. And if you are seated, Caitlin's going to bring both of her legs to one side, and as she does that, her, her whole upper body is gonna twist to the other side, including her arms. She's gonna keep switching to each side, all right? Here we go for one minute, we're gonna do those ski jumps downhill. In three, two, one, let's go. All right, guys, so we are moving down that hill, however you feel best. We could be in a championship race, or we could just be going down for some fun here. Woo, getting that body moving. Awesome. Good job, guys, good job. All right. So halfway here, team. Let's go, let's go. Nicely done. You got it, guys. That's our last one. Woo. Make oh. it count. Here we go. Finish line just ahead. 10 seconds here, guys. Here we go. In five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Good job, guys. Shake it out, shake it out. Grab a quick drink and then we'll move into our snowflake fitness. Nice. For our snowflake fitness activity today, myself and Victoria have a screen dividing the two of us. And on the screen, we have various snowflakes consisting of different movements and different numbers. So on my side, I have a bunch of blue snowflakes that are gonna have various exercise movements. On Victoria's side, she has various purple snowflakes that are gonna have all different numbers on them. So we're each going to pick one. We're gonna put our snowflakes together and we are going to do that movement based on whatever number Victoria picked, all right? So however you wanna participate, I'm gonna be seated, Victoria's gonna be standing, and let's get started. So I'm gonna start here, nice and simple. I'm gonna pick this nice little blue one off here. Nice, I picked squats. All right, all right, all Victoria. Right. I think I'm gonna pick, I think, <laughs> so many options. I think I'm gonna pick one on the bottom too. Okay. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch up out this one. Okay. On the left good, good or pick, the right. Good pick. Five. Oh, All right, nice. we got five squats. Nice. So if you are standing for these squats, we are going to start with our feet shoulder width apart. We're gonna sit back into our heels like we're sitting on a chair, keeping that chest up nice and tall. And then we're gonna stand right back up and then right back down to that squat and back up. If you are seated like Caitlin, she is going to alternate bringing those knees up to her chest and in between each leg, she's going to lean her upper body forward before bringing in that other leg. All right, here we go. We got five squats in three, 
two, one, let's go. Woo! All right, there's one. There's two. Nice, three, four, and five. Woo! Nice. Good job, good Great job. job. Alright, Caitlin, go ahead, pick up right. the snowflake. Um, I'm gonna stand up here and I'm going to pick one off of the top. So mm, here I go. Okay. I have a blue one off the top here. And I have picked running on the spot. Ooh, okay, okay. Nice. All right. Let me see, let me see. This okay. okay. Oh, get oh, you got 12. Nice. 12 seconds of running on the spot. So if you are seated in a chair, all we're gonna do here is we're gonna get our arms pumping, we're gonna alternate our left and right feet here, and we're gonna run as fast or as slow as you like. If you're standing, same idea here. Get those feet moving, alternating our right and left, get those arms pumping, and participate how you feel best. So we're gonna get the timer on. Here we go, guys, in three, two, and one. 12 seconds, let's go, let's go. As fast or as slow as you want, let's go. Whew. Here we go, here we go. You got it, don't stop, keep moving. All right, we're there in five, four, three, two, and one. Nice. Woo! Good All job, right. good job. Now the workout down. All right, go ahead, Caitlin. Pick okay. Your snowflake. Okay, I'm going to pick um, bottom right here. I'm Woo! This guy. Oh, my favorite, favorite, my favorite. Burpees. This one's a tricky one. I love burpees. All right. How many burpees? This could really count. How many burpees do we got? Mm, this one. Okay. That's a good pick. Good pick. Here we go. Ten, Ten. burpees. Woo. All righty. Here we go. If you are standing for these burpees, what we're going to do, we're going to have our feet about shoulder width apart. We're going to jump up in the air. And as we come down, my hands are gonna come down to the ground and my feet are gonna shoot back behind me, almost like I'm in a plank position. I'm gonna jump them back up and I'm back up, ready for my next burpee. All right, and if you are seated, Kayla's gonna shoot her hands up in the air. When she comes down, she's gonna shoot them down to the ground, touch the ground or as far as she can, and then back to her starting position, ready to shoot those arms up again. All right, so this one, take your time, go at your own pace, we're going to do 10 burpees together. Here we go. In three, two, one, let's go. All right, shooting my arms up, reaching for the ground here. That's one. Good job, guys. We got two, three, four. All right, five, we're halfway, let's go. Keep it up. Six, seven, woo! One more. Nine. Last one, Victoria. Let's go, let's go. And Woo. ten. All right. Woo. Good Woo. job, guys. Good job. I think we got a couple more in us. Oh, yeah, absolutely. All right. All right. Um, so I'm going to stand up here, and I'm going to come I'm gonna come to uh, this guy up here to my top left. All right. All right. And I've picked bent over rows. Ooh, OK. OK. Bent over rows. All right. How many are we going to do? How many, how many are you gonna do, Victoria? Ooh. Let's see, let's see. Seven! Ooh. All right. All right, guys, so we're gonna do seven bent over rows here. So, for a bent over rows, if you are seated or standing, you're gonna hinge at your hips, okay? So your chest is gonna be slightly forward. I want you to bring your arms out in front of you, and you're gonna make two fists, okay? So your two um, fists are going to be touching. All we're going to do is we're going to pull our fist to our chest and shoot those elbows behind us, okay? Squeezing those shoulder blades at the back. So same movement here, standing and seated, okay? So you can go nice and slow, squeezing those shoulder blades and really feeling this resistance exercise, all right? So we're just doing seven bent over rows here. Here we go in three, two, and one. So here, bent over, row back, one. Feel that squeeze, two, awesome. Three, you got it. Four, almost there. Five, six, and last one, seven. Woo! Nice, nice. Those shoulders will roll out. Nice, nice work. Good job, good job. All right, 
Let's continue on here. We got a couple more. Okay, I'm gonna pick. I'm gonna pick this guy right to the middle in front of me. Uh, Russian twist. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. Here we go. How many are we gonna do? Let's see. Which one? Good job. Eleven. Eleven. Eleven Russian twists. Good pick. Good pick. Alrighty. So. If you are doing this, let's. Uh, you can do this one on the ground. I'm gonna turn to the side. We're gonna sit on our bum. We're starting with our heels on the ground, and then we're gonna slowly. You can cross them if you'd like. We're gonna lift them up, so we're kind of balancing on our tailbone almost. We can put our hands together. That's a little bit easier. Kind of clasp our fingers together, and we're gonna twist our upper body side to side, trying as hard as we can to keep those feet off the ground. I'm gonna, we're gonna work on those abs. Woo. All right, if you are seated in a chair, Caitlin is going to scooch up to the front of her chair. She's gonna lean back so her feet are off the ground if she would like, and really engaging those abs. And again, she's gonna twist side to side. She can also put her feet on the ground and just lean nice far as back as she can without leaning on her chair. And same thing, twist that upper body. All right, so we're gonna do 11 Russian twists together. Here we go. In three, two, one, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Last one, 11. Nice. Amazing. Woo. We are almost there, guys. I think. I think we're good for one more. Yeah, one Let's more. Let's do one more. Final snowflake pick here. All here right. we go. Here we go. Got it. All right. Final snowflake pick. Here we go. All right, I'm gonna go for a top right here. Ooh, top right, top right. right. And top we have right. boxing arm. Ooh, I like that one. All right, I'll do the same thing. I'll go top right. All right, can you top reach right. that? Here you go. Yeah, good. Nice. Let's see what it is. 15. Woo! All, All right. right. 15. Ending off with 15, 15 seconds boxing of arms. boxing arms. All right. All right. So uh, we're gonna get in our boxing stance here, all right? To loosen everything up, add a little bounce, a bounce to our step, all right? We're going to put those arms up in front of us, all right? Making those fists. Victoria is standing. She's gonna have her right foot forward, left foot back in her boxing stance, okay? I'm seated. You know my feet are going to be together. All we're going to do here is we're just gonna alternate extending that right and left arm out in front of us. You can go as fast or as slow as you guys would like. If you don't wanna do boxing arms here, you can also do some fast feet on the spot, whatever you feel best, all right? So we're gonna do some boxing for 15 seconds. Here we go, guys, in three, two, and one. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's see those jabs. Yeah. Here we go, here we go. Woo -hoo. Keep it up, this is our last one. We got this. Here we go, guys, here we go. Here we go, five. Four, three, two, and one. Woo! Woo! Nicely done. Wow, we crushed that workout. Grab a quick drink and we're gonna do a nice cool down. For our cool down, let's work through a couple stretches to stretch all our muscles out and get us ready for the next session. So let's begin with some neck rolls. So chin is going to come down to my chest and all I'm going to do here is I'm gonna roll my chin up to my right shoulder back down to the middle of my chest and then up to my left. All right, so alternating here, going nice and slow. No need for speed. Awesome. Let's do 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Woo. Nice. Awesome. All right, our next one, we're gonna do some arm crossover. So I'm gonna take my right arm first, and whether you're standing or seated, you're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna shoot that arm across our body, and I'm gonna use my left hand to place it on my right elbow and just pull that arm in, feeling a nice stretch in my right shoulder. All right, so let's hold that again. Five, four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. And we're gonna do our other arm. So this time our left arm is gonna go across our body. Use our right hand to pull that elbow in. Feeling that stretch in our left shoulder. Holding for five, four, three, two, and one. Shake that. Whew, nice, that feels nice. 
Moving into our straddle arch here. So if you are standing or seated, we're going to move our feet wider than hip width apart. So we're making a nice straddle here. I'm going to place my right hand on my right hip, shooting my left arm up to the sky above my head. Now I'm going to lean over towards that side that my hand is hip is on. So I'm gonna lean over to my right here, hold it, feeling that stretch all the way up the left side of my body. We'll hold this for five, four, three, two, and one. So switching sides here, bring my left arm to my left hip, shooting that right arm up above my head and then leaning over to that side, which my hand is on my hip. So that's my left here, feeling that stretch all the way down our arm and our body. Holding it for five, four, three, two, and one. Whew, nice. Our last one, we're gonna do some ankle rolls. So we're gonna start with our right foot, digging those right toes into the ground, and we're gonna make circular shapes with our ankle. All right, so let's do that for five, four, three, two, and one. Switching to our left foot. Here we go. Left toes into the ground. Five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome. All right guys, let's shake everything out. Shake out those arms, shake out those legs, shake out those hips. And we'll finish off with a nice deep breath in and out. And that is today's power and strength session. Thank you guys for joining us and we will see you next time. Until we move again. Woo, bye. Bye guys. You, me, we, move. Be kind, be brave, be you.